Hello everyone, um, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new. Hello, my name is Leah Kay and I am a cast member here at Walt Disney World Resort in Orlando, Florida. And I am here on my Disney College program. Um, and today I'm going to be filming a video that I kind of want to start like turning into a series. So it's no secret that cast members do get discounts on things like merchandise here at Walt Disney World and I have definitely been um, utilizing that discount quite a bit. Um, and so what I wanted to do today is kind of film a video of everything that I have bought so far on my college program because it's been almost a month since my college program started and I have bought a lot more than I should have and my bank account is def definitely suffering from it. But um, I figured this could be like a cool series that I start so like every month I show you guys what I've bought and then at the end of my program I can kind of do like a collective haul so you guys can see everything that I bought on my program. Um, let me know if you guys would be interested in a video like this. I have no idea, but um, I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. Um, before I do, I wanna give a little disclaimer that everything that I'm gonna show, I have bought with my own money, money that I've earned from working. Um, so no one has sent me this, Disney hasn't sent me this, which they would, because then I would have money. Um, but, and I also wanted to say that if you like this video, um, please be sure to give it a thumbs up, and hey, um, if you're new to my channel and you're not already subscribed, be sure to click the subscribe button down there. So let's get started. So I think I'm going to start with like these smaller things and like work my way up to like like clothing items. So the smallest of the smallest things that I have bought are pins. I love pins. I have quite a few of them that I've bought so far. Um, just because they're really good souvenirs and they're not too expensive and I already have these are all the ones I've bought so far. Um, I already have a couple that I like had previously starting my program and I just want to show you guys a lot of them that I have bought so far. I'm gonna notice a theme of that 90% um, of them are Tangled themed pins because that's my favorite movie. Um, so I'm gonna be showing like close-ups but I'm just gonna talk about each pin right now. So this first one is Rapunzel holding um, her lantern. But the only thing that bothers me about this is that the sign on the lantern looks nothing like the sun on the actual lanterns. You'll see what I mean. Um, this one came in a set, I believe. No, this one did not. But I did get a set, so I bought this one individually. The next, like, four came in a set. So I got this at World of Disney and Disney Springs, and the first one that came in the set is Rapunzel's tower. It's really cute. I've never seen a pin that had her tower on it. And then it also came with a lantern. A lantern. A Pascal. And then of course my girl, Punzi, just her by herself. Um, the next one I got is of my man's, Eugene Fitzherbert. It's like a little wanted poster and it has arrows sticking out of it and it says dead or alive. We actually did get his notes right in this one, so you're welcome, Eugene. And then these are the pins I got that aren't Tangled related. Um, in case you didn't know, I'm a lifeguard. I work at Disney's Down Beach Club at Stormalong Bay. And so I got this Beach Club pin. It has Ariel on it. Um, it says Disney's Beach Club Resort. I'm still looking for a Yacht Club pin because at all the places, at the place I got this, they didn't have a Yacht Club pin, which didn't really make sense, but you know, um, I'll find one eventually, so. Yacht Club, I mean, Beach Club, and then the last pin I got, I got this at Tatooine Traders in Hollywood Studios, and it's a little, it says join the resistance, and it has the resistance symbol on it, so. Those are the pins that I've gotten. This next thing is like very, very, very random. Um, I got this from Basin White in um, the Grand Floridian, the resort, and it is a lip scrub. When I first got here, my lips were like extremely chapped and I had a bunch of dead skin. So <laughs> that's really appealing. So um, I got this and it's the lime sugar one. This stuff tastes so good. Like I know you're not supposed to eat it, but it's edible and it tastes really good. Um, so there's that, I guess. So. Again, I'm going to be showing a close-up of it because I know you can't see it from far away. But the first keychain I have gotten, I love keychains, I like collect them. You should have seen my keys when I first got here, but my keys got too heavy and they broke. So the first one that I got is this Hollywood Tower Hotel keychain. It looks like 
the little leather thing that hangs off of like an actual hotel room key. So it says Hollywood, the Hollywood Tower Hotel on the front and then on the back it says room 1313 and thanks for dropping in. So there's that. And I bought this too even though it's not like Disney related. Um, I love Harry Potter. I'm a very big Harry Potter fan and I am a very proud of my house. I'm a Hufflepuff. Um, so when I went there I got a little Hufflepuff tie. It's like fabric and it's a little Hufflepuff tie keychain. That's very, very, very cute. I love it so much. So those are the keychains that I got. Okay. Next thing I have gotten so far is this Puwa plush. He's so cute. I had a Pascal plush, which is like more on brand for me, but um, my dog ate it at home and they don't sell it anymore, which makes me very, very, very sad. Um, Disney, fix it, please. I just want Pascal back, man. Um, so. Here's Pua. He's very cute. He's very soft. I cuddle with him every night. Yeah. This is the only pair of ears I have gotten on my program, and it's the only pair of ears, ears I wear. Um, a lot of the Disney, like Disney branded ears, give me such a bad headache, except for these. I think they've like redone them, so they're not as painful. But like these, I can wear these for like hours and not get a headache. So these are the, I think these are the Millennial Pink ears they're pretty basic they're like the headbands they're sequined and then they have like a big chunky bow on them so if you've seen any of my vlogs when i'm in the parks or following me on instagram i'm literally always wearing these because they're the only pair of they're the only pair of ears that i have so so in case you didn't know um there's a starbucks in every single disney park so magic kingdom epcot you know you know what i mean and i went to magic kingdom on valentine's day if you saw my last vlog and it was the last day of our 40% discount before it dropped back down to 20. And we, me and Vanessa saw these. They're the um, like acrylic tumblers, and it has Disney designs on it. So um, I got this. I'll show a close-up of it so you can actually see the details. But it has like the castle, Tower of Terror. Don't really know what that's supposed to be. Sorry. That might be Disney Springs. I don't know. They have the Epcot Ball, Tree of Life, Dumbo. Oh, they have Mickey's Fun Wheel. Okay. Okay. Got that. Tinkerbell. Small World. Dumbo. Yeah, I literally use this all the time. I just put drinks in it and carry it around with me. It's great. 10 out of 10 would recommend. It wasn't too expensive. So. Yeah. And now we are going to move on to clothing. So I haven't actually bought that much clothing, which I'm very proud of myself for. Um, but I have bought a couple things that I wear like all the time and I want to show you guys. So, this is on top of the pile, so I'll show it first. So, this is the Disney Parks like sweatshirt. It has all of the Disney Parks on it. So, it's gray. Um, it has Magic Kingdom, Animal Kingdom, Epcot, Hollywood Studios. Um, it says Walt Disney World somewhere. It's on the back, but down here it says Discover the Magic, and then on the sleeves it says Walt Disney World, and then on the back it has a little Mickey compass. Um, I'm a big fan of very large sweatshirts, so I can like wear them with just like leggings and stuff or Nike shorts um, to work. That's what I usually do before I change into my costume. And I got this in an extra large, and I know that sounds like crazy, but it's not. It doesn't fit like an extra large at all. Like not at all. I'm kind of disappointed in that, but it's very soft and warm, and I love it. So the next two things I got, the next two things I got were t-shirts. So the first one is the, oh, there's makeup on that, okay. That's embarrassing, okay. The first thing that, the first t-shirt I got is the Walt Disney World entrance sign. It's like a light blue t-shirt and it's the sign that you see whenever you drive onto Walt Disney World property. So for dreams come true, it's got my guy Minnie, my guy Mick, Mick Mouse. Are you Mick Mouse? Why no, don't what? you get in your spaceship like Mick Mouse? What are you talking about? Mick Mouse. What is a Mick Mouse? Mick Mouse. I don't understand what Mick Mouse is. Mick Mouse. I don't understand. I don't know what, what does that mean. What's a Mick Mouse? Mick Mouse. Are you saying Mickey Mouse? Yes. Um, real cute. The way I usually wear this, and the other one that I'm gonna show you in a minute is I like tie it. So, like this, I'll wear it with like a pair of jean shorts and I'll just tie it and it's real cute. And they have those t-shirts like literally everywhere. Like I know they have them at Walt Disney, Disney Springs, Emporium, 
mouse gear probably. They have them everywhere. Like they're not hard to find. And then the last Disney t-shirt that I got is um, yellow is my favorite color, in case you couldn't tell. Oh, um, so it's this like bright yellow t-shirt and it's kind of retro looking. It says Walt Disney World in a bunch of different colors and like I said it's really retro looking and I'll wear it the same way that I wear the entrance sign one. I'll tie it. So that is all of the Disney stuff I've gotten but I do have one more thing I want to show you. It's universal but you know. Who cares? Um, like I said before, I'm a Hufflepuff. Love my house. And I've been wanting a Quidditch themed shirt for a while and a lot of them like looked really bad and I was walking out of Islands of Adventure the other night and I saw this bad thing. So, it's just like a normal t-shirt. Obviously, it's a t-shirt, but it's like a Quidditch jersey. It's yellow, so it says Hufflepuff 07. And then, this is the best part. Ready for the back? Diggory, my man's Cedric, RIP, I miss you so much. But um, I was like, oh, that's cute. And then I flipped it over and saw that said Diggory on the back and I immediately bought it. Um, I think they have them for all the houses. So if you're not a Hufflepuff for Gryffindor, I'm pretty sure it says Potter on the back. Slytherin says Malfoy. I'm not so sure about the Ravenclaw one. Maybe it says Cho Chang to get some representation for my girl Cho Chang. But I'm not sure about that. I will look it up and like maybe let you know. So that is everything that I have bought in the first month of my Disney College program. Um, my bank account is definitely suffering for it, but you know, who cares? Like, how long am I going to live in Disney? <laughs> um, but yeah, if you guys liked these videos and want to see more of them, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up so I know, or leave a comment down below if you're interested and want to see more of these hauls throughout the time of my program. Um, some other videos that I have coming are I'm going to try and do like vlog like every day for a week. So like you guys can see what it, like what every day looks like for me in my Disney College program, and then um, at some point once we get like all of our decorations in, because all of the decorations still are not in, I will be doing an apartment tour. Yay! Um, but yeah, that is it for this video. Again, if you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up, and if you want to see more from me, go ahead and click the subscribe button. You know, it doesn't hurt. It really helps me out. Um, thank you guys. Bye. I'll see you next time.